hey guys welcome to protocoders point okay so in this tutorial let's learn the correct way to print logs on our console so basically when we make use of print statement to print logs on our console the half of a data from the list given list will get truncated for example if our data length is greater than 1020 character and we are trying to print the data at once by making use of print statement the half of the data will get truncated so only 1020 characters will be dis displayed on our console so for example here i have created a list by making use of list generator and i am just creating one 10200 uh, data in it and and i'm just trying to print it by making use of print statement okay so you can see the result over here okay so only 1,020 characters are getting printed over here so i'll just show you the proof so i'll just copy this okay so i will just make use of an online tool to count the characters so i'm just pasting it over here so you can see 1,022 characters are getting printed over here okay and remaining data that is uh, 10,020 are getting missed from the console okay so here is the right way to print a logs in flutter app development okay so instead of making use of print statement we can make use of development uh, log okay so first of all here we need to import developer okay and import it as uh, anything you can name it so I will just name it log div and then I can make use of this to print the data okay so here let me print it so log div dot log and here we need to pass two character two parameters one is a message and another is the name of this log so name and you can just name it as anything so I will just name it as my logs okay and now here I will just pass this data to print on my console dot to string okay so you can see I will just refresh or restart my app okay so the app is running on my device let's wait okay so you saw all the data that has been generated is getting printed on my console without any without losing any data so this is the right way to print logs in flutter app development okay so that's all for this video tutorial hope you got the concept of how to make use of logs in flutter thanks for watching please do subscribe protocol as point thank you